Thank you, bro. Amir Khan has a very tough challenge, but you, Andre Berto, Victor Ortiz, all are saying that he could pull it out. I mean, it's not going to be an easy fight for either guy. Um, but this is what we say we want in boxing. You know, I see a lot of people ripping Amir, but he's got the guts to take the, to take the challenge. He's chasing this. And whether he wins or loses, he took the risk. So, man, I take my hat off to the kid. And th him winning this fight is, is by no means out of the question. And Amir's a lot bigger than what people realize. I can attest um, to that. I, mean, I, I haven't seen Amir in a yeah. while, and I saw him today. He's huge. And the people think, yeah, he's not a small kid, and he's got a lot of heart, and, and you know, Virgil's going to have a great game plan, and I know Canelo's going to have a great game plan. It's going to be a great fight, but this is what, this is what we want in boxing, these type of matchups. So I tip my hat to both guys. Definitely. You're undefeated. When do you think you're going to start putting your legacy on the line with each fight? When does it get to that point where you start thinking, you know what, man, I'm almost at the end. Every fight's counting even more. Well, I know, I know this. I know, I know I'm on the back stretch of my career. That's the reality of it. Now, how long that stretch is, I don't know. Five years, three years, I don't know. But, you know, I feel like the first stretch was, you know, building my way up to a title. And then it, it was consummated with the Super Six. And then, you know, the middle was kind of rocky with the last couple of years of inconsistency. And now I'm on the back stretch. I mean, like I said, I'm over 10 years. I turned pro in December 2004. So I've been in this a while. So I'm on the back stretch right now. And I want to make every opportunity count. And I want to close out strong. You said 40. That's that's the limit. No more. Not You're not going to hit 40 and not want to fight. It's anything 40 and below? Or is there a specific number that you have? I don't have a specific number, but I definitely don't want to be 40 <laughs> in a box. I just don't. Like, mm. this, it's hard enough being young and being in shape and, you know, having your reflexes. Like, I, but you got to realize a guy like Bernard started late. Bernard started at 22, 23 because, you know, I started at 9. So I got a lot of miles on me when he got his miles on the back end. So it's a little bit different. So, yeah, I don't think I should be in a boxing ring at 40. All right, guys, we got to wrap up. Okay. You might be the new 40. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Hey, Chad, I just want to say good night, Chad. Have a good one. Thank you. I saw Chad on the back side. Okay.